Hey everyone, this is David B. with another video to help you improve your English. Today is November 11th, which is Veterans Day in the USA. Veterans Day is a holiday to honor those who served in the military. So I want to analyze the lyrics to the song Veterans Day by the Tom Russell Band from their 1990 album Poor Man's Dream. Tom Russell is an American singer-songwriter and I'll put a link to this song in the description. And there's also a version of this song that was done by Johnny Cash. And I'll put a link to that as well. So the song starts out, I used to hang out down at the local VFW hall. So hang out means just casually visit and stay around there. VFW hall. VFW stands for Veterans of Foreign Wars. And it's a membership organization for veterans. I was staring at the photographs up on the wall of all the boys in the neighborhood who died back in World War II, and a hand-lettered sign said, Remember our Jimmy McGrew. Jimmy McGrew is just a fictional character in this song. The fact that it's a hand-lettered sign that someone maybe just made at home rather than something nice that was manufactured really ties in with the rest of the meaning of the song. I also want to point out this word, our. Remember, our Jimmy McGrew. That's just sort of a, a term of endearment. He's someone local. He's someone that had meaning to us. It's not just remember Jimmy McGrew. It's remember our Jimmy McGrew. Well, Jimmy went away back in 1965, which was the time of the Vietnam War. And actually, in the Johnny Cash version of the song, he says, Jimmy went to Nam, or Vietnam, which is an alternate pronunciation of Vietnam. Jimmy went to Nam in 1965. There's a lot of men here who think Jimmy McGrew's still alive. So this tells us that Jimmy never came home, but there's a lot of people that think he wasn't killed, but that maybe he's still living over there. They carved his name on a stone down in Washington, D.C. That would be a memorial where they put the names of all the soldiers who were killed. But his brother says, that stone don't mean a damn thing to me. And again, in the Johnny Cash version, they took out the word damn, which is a little bit of a swear word or profanity. But I think it really adds a lot of power to the song. You can imagine somebody whose brother went off to fight in the Vietnam War and never returned home. And he might feel just the injustice of the system and the government and just war in general. There could be a lot of anger there. And maybe he feels that it doesn't matter that his brother's name was put on this memorial as being killed, but that maybe his brother's still alive. But there's just a, a lot of anger to that word. Now we get to the chorus of the song. The chorus is the part that repeats. It's Veterans Day and the skies are gray. A couple of things I want to point out here. Here, I did not put an apostrophe between the N and the S, whereas in the song title, there is an apostrophe. When the song was published, they spelled it with an apostrophe, but actually the official spelling is the way I have it here with no apostrophe because it's a day to celebrate veterans. It's not a day that veterans own. So it's not possessive, it's just the plural. Also, you'll hear the word veterans pronounced two different ways. You can pronounce it with two syllables, like it is in the Tom Russell version. It's Veterans Day. Or three syllables, like in the Johnny Cash version. It's Veterans Day. So both of those are correct pronunciations veterans or veterans. The skies are gray, telling us that this isn't a happy song. This isn't a happy topic. It's a cloudy day and the mood matches it. Leave your uniforms home, boys. There ain't gonna be a parade. A uniform is the clothing that someone wears for their work. So in this case, a military uniform. There ain't gonna be a parade. To say that with proper grammar, we would say there isn't going to be a parade. So in other words, don't dress up, 
There's not going to be a parade. We're not going to be celebrating. A parade would be something that uh, a town might have on Veterans Day where you would have police and fire trucks and marching band and veterans marching and just a, a big celebration. So the song is saying there isn't going to be a parade. We're not celebrating. But we'll fill up a glass for the ones who didn't make it through. So they're going to be drinking alcohol and they're going to fill a beer for the for the friends who didn't survive the war. So it's, it's just saying we're remembering our friends who were killed. And leave a light in the window tonight for Jimmy McGrew. Leaving a light on in the window at night would be a symbolic gesture to show that you're waiting for someone to come home. We move on to the final verse. There's a hot rain falling on the back streets of Saigon. So if we didn't get the earlier reference that 1965 means the Vietnam War, here we have a specific reference to Saigon, which is a city in Vietnam. And there's a white man running down the alley with his mama son. Mama son is a word that can be used to refer to an, an Asian woman who is the boss of a bar or some other kind of establishment. Um, it can also be used just as a term to describe any Asian woman in her 50s or 60s. It's not a very common term to hear, but in this case, it's just uh, a reference to this white man and his older Asian wife or girlfriend. But Lord, his eyes are cloudy and his arms are black and blue. So eyes being cloudy just means not good health, maybe not completely there mentally. His arms are black and blue. He has bruises on him, so he's physically beat up. And he's a hanging by a thread, and he looks like our Jimmy McGrew. Hanging by a thread, you can imagine literally if something's hanging by a thread, it means it's just barely hanging on and it could get broken easily. So when using to refer to a person, it just means like they're struggling a lot, they're barely hanging in there in life. Um, this A, he's a hanging, that's just to um, better connect these words. So if we were writing it out, we might just say, and he's hanging by a thread. And then the, the real kicker comes at the end, and he looks like our Jimmy McGrew. So in other words, Jimmy McGrew is still alive over in Vietnam. Why is he still over there? Why didn't he make it back home? We're not really told, but this song just recognizes that phenomenon that there were many soldiers killed, but there were others who um, may have ended up stranded over in Vietnam and never made it home. Okay, those were the lyrics to the song Veterans Day by Tom Russell. I hope you enjoyed this, and again, check out the song and check out Tom Russell's other songs. I think you'll really enjoy them. This is David B. Thanks for watching.